And it's nice just to have those tools kind of hanging right out in the open. So that's why we're going to be installing this stuff. The generic name for this is Slot Wall. It's made on very, very tough plastic, 15 inches wide, 4 and 8 foot lengths. Comes in a lot of colors. We're using gray to match uh, the decor going in here. Now installing this stuff is very easy. It hangs off these metal brackets. These come 45 inches long. They do have perforations every 15 inches. So if you're working on a shorter area like this backsplash here, you just bend them and they pop right off. Now to hang the stuff, you just screw these into concrete or framing. Of course, you want to make sure they're all plumb. And of course, you want to make sure that all the hangers line up level to each other across the wall. Now once those are in, then you just take the slot wall and you start working from the bottom up. Place it over the top of the brackets and just kind of slide them down like so. And they just hook into those. Now the nice thing about this is you don't have to screw through the front at all. And also if there's any contraction or expansion in the winter time, you don't have to worry about anything buckling because it just kind of moves up and down on top of those. Let me just uh, tap this down here a little bit, Lenny. Yeah. And if you have a length longer than eight feet, they're actually pre-drilled, so you can use dowels to connect them to keep them all in the same plane. Now, the end of our slot wall comes with this decorative trim that you just put over the end like so. Now, to attach that, we're using this magnetic tape. It'll work pretty slick because we can just set our trim right over the edge, make sure we adhere this real well to the tape, and then we can just pop this off and stick it back on whenever we want to. And the reason we're doing that is because some of the hangers that we're going to be using you know, they go on fine on the slots from here down, but this top one, it's a little difficult. So this way we can just slide it on like so, and then pop our trim back like this. And it's a pretty slick operation.